Bridge between Chelsea and Everton, both coming off defeats, but trying to stay in the title hunt. Hullet was in the starting lineup for Chelsea, Di Matteo was on the bench, the injured Hughes was missing, as was Barmby for Everton. Tony Gubber was at the game. Everton coming into this fixture off the back of four very impressive Premiership results, two wins and two draws. Eight points from the last 12, Everton have won. Ferguson trying to retrieve this. Finds Kachelskis, he's got two to look for. Well, neither referee's assistant nor referee saw anything wrong with that. Will Barrett may get dispossessed, and he has, here's Dennis Wise. Well, it's certainly a free kick. Parkinson having a little word with Dennis Wise, but Chelsea with a chance there to punish some slack defending by Everton. We've had just over 10 minutes, and Gianfranco Zola has placed the ball for this Chelsea free kick. It's dead centre to Gusto. Branch to Konchelskis, who's got Tony Grant in support on his inside. Here is Grant, Konchelskis. Dennis Wise in with a good tackle. Unsworth aimed at Ferguson, who knocks it down. His speed in behind them. Yes, it's in. It's a first goal for young Michael Branch, 18 years of age. It was Ferguson who won the ball in the air and knocked it down, initially aimed at Gary Speed. But it was the teenager Michael Branch, the England under-21 international, who stole in to score his first goal at senior level and make it 1-1. And we've not yet had 18 minutes. It's got a long way away from Petrescu, but Chelsea have it back with Eddie Newton. Rude Hullet. Oh, it's good play by Hullet, although Unsworth tried to pull him back. Well, Viali went down on the edge of the penalty area, and I think a free kick has been given. It has. Can the Italian do it for a second time? Oh, that time he didn't quite get it over the wall. Somebody able to get tall enough to knock it over for the corner. the head of Gary Speed, Newton missed his kick. It's Michael Dubry who couldn't quite keep his feet. Neat back heel though by Viali, Hullet! Oh, it was a bullet header, and somehow it went over the crossbar from the player manager, who's playing himself today with uh, Mark Hughes still suffering from that injury. Midway through this first half. Duncan Ferguson into the path of Gary Speed. Look how quickly LeBeuf came out to claim it. That's aimed at Konchelskis, and Clark has missed it. Here's Konchelskis. Everton have come back from being a goal down, and now they lead 2-1. It's the first time, really, that Konchelskis has got free of the close marking of Steve Clark. And once the ball had dropped over the head of the defender, you always felt that Konchelskis wouldn't waste that sort of an opportunity. Earl Barrett. It's won by Zola. Here's Rude Hullitz, faced by Watson. Zola's continued his run. Zola. for space, oh, and the header off the top of the crossbar. How much more have Chelsea got to do to take the lead? 
maybe Everton have survived that spell of Chelsea pressure beginning now to get the ball back up into the Chelsea penalty area Hinchcliffe that's one for Ferguson to fight for and win oh it's a, a rebound off the berth which was almost an own goal Grodash pushed it over but signs of nerves in defence header out but only as far as wise here's Eddie Newton still time for a final shake of the dice straight into the arms of Southall off the head of Petrescu and for as close as Chelsea have come to winning this match it does look now as if it will end to a piece as a coach you can't co you can't coach against that because the ball doesn't want to go in and it's already the second time that it happened here also against Newcastle same thing done everything ball doesn't want to go in and uh, hit the post again and uh, whatever <laughs> so uh, yeah it's one of these uh, days and um, I hope that we that one day we uh, we break that second half really we didn't didn't perform you know, I felt first half we were comfortable uh, their goal came from a somewhat disputed free kick and we felt we should have had a penalty when Andre Kinchelsis was pulled down because uh, without being too political he's one of the foreigners in this country that doesn't dive but um, nevertheless we went in two and a half time and, and we knew they'd come at us the team to today uh, didn't win the game uh, so um, I'm, I'm, I'm going to be happy Completely. Uh, when you win. When you win. <laughs> when you win. <laughs> well, there was a bit of comedy around the Chelsea goal there today. It was hardly surprising, really, is it, with Frank Skinner in goal? Yes. <laughs> we reckon this was the phoenix from the flames, didn't we, come in here? When, I mean, it was a mix-up in the end, wasn't it, between uh, Le Buff and Dennis Wise, but a good save, and we wondered who the keeper was, and That's then Frank, it was revealed. It? Frank does really well. Frank. In fact, somebody said that he's a better keeper than he is a comedian. But it wasn't me, Frank. <laughs> yeah. Not me either. Yeah. We're, we're looking out for a David Baddiel look-alike. That might take a little longer. 